Author Gail Rubin uses gentle humor and funny films to convey the vital information about funeral arrangements that most people don't learn about until faced with a death in the family. On Thursday, you can catch one of these funny films. French Funerals and Cremations is hosting a free screening of Get Low, starring Robert Duvall, Sissy Spacek, Bill Murray, and Lucas Black. And here's a first look. You read the paper today? People are dying in bunches everywhere but here. What do you do when people won't die? I'm after a funeral. Boy, are you in luck. Solid pecan, steel handles, whatever you want. Party. A what? A funeral party. And I want to be there. You will be, I guarantee you. I want to be there now. You can't have a funeral if you're not deceased. It's a detail, pretty big detail. I want everybody to come who's got a story to tell about me. How do you get people to come tell stories about you that I'm guessing might get them, you know, shot? Is it just me, or is he extremely articulate when he wants to be? Fancy car for the dead. Didn't buy it for them. We have a plan. We're going to run an ad in some papers about your party. Do you want him to smile? That is his smile. Huh. Crazy old nutter draws more. Oh, for heaven's sakes. I wondered if you were still under that beard. Wouldn't know where else to go. How do you know, Maddie? We had a go. <laughs> Mr. Felix Bush, the mysterious hermit from Caleb County. How are you today, sir? I am. Good. years ago, he was the most interesting man I'd ever met. And I don't just mean the way he looked. Now, where are the shoes? Normally, people don't wear shoes in the caskets, so. How you fix for underwear? I don't wear none. One question too many. You know, good. I haven't seen the movie, but doesn't it look really good? It looks fantastic. Let's and the doyen of death, Gail Rubin, is Hi. joining us with more details. Welcome back. Glad to be here. Okay, so we have to ask you that we heard in the trailer them mention that Robert Duvall plays Felix Bush. So why do you think he was so remarkable? We already know the actor certainly is. Well, the real Felix Bush was 74 years old when he decided he wanted to have his funeral while he was still alive, mm -hmm. just so he could enjoy the party <laughs> with everyone else. And it was a media sensation in 1938. The, wow. the story was picked up by the Associated Press. Eight to 12,000 people turned out in the middle of rural Tennessee for this wow. guy's funeral. Wow. Cars from 14 states came. So this is a true story It then. is a true story. Well, can you tell us a little bit more about how Get Low portrays this true story and how close it is to the real? There thing? are some dramatic okay. differences. Felix Bush was a bachelor okay. all of his life, but he lived with his parents, and then after mm -hmm. his parents died, he lived with his nephew. Okay. So there's so a difference there. He never lived alone. There. Right. Okay. Right. He so was in Hollywood his... eyes just a bit. Yeah. But... He was a farmer and a fox hunter. Right. So I think he was a little more polished looking than the <laughs> Felix Bush in the movie right. as a hermit. Okay. But he did live five more years after his living funeral. Wow. <laughs> and what he a did great say, story. And he did say he didn't want another funeral because this was quite a big already... blowout. <laughs> and wow. actually, after this big event, uh, Robert Ripley, who was a big columnist and a radio personality uh -huh. took him to New York City in 1938 to be on the radio, which is sort of like going to New York to be on one of the morning shows. Sure, oh, yeah, sure. A big deal big back deal. then. Yeah, yeah. That is so cool. cool. I mean, it really looks so good. And what you're doing is a free movie night, which I think is great. So tell us more about it and how people can participate in that. Uh, the folks at French Funerals and Cremations at their Rio Rancho Center uh -huh. Uh, volunteered to host this movie night showing, which is an idea that came out of a deaf cafe that I did oh, a yes. month ago, where they said, wouldn't it be cool to watch a movie and then talk about issues that mm -hmm. it raises? Mm -hmm. And there's lots of great issues that we'll be talking about. And right, and this is kind of how you do things. This movie is light, it has some comedy to it, and so mm -hmm. you're kind of working people into talking about this subject a lot of people don't want to talk about. So can you tell us about some of the other ways that you help start funeral planning conversations 
with humor? A light touch on a serious subject. Mm -hmm. I created a game called the Newly Dead Game. Which <laughs> the is Newly like, Deads. Oh, gosh. Like the Newly Wed Game, but the questions <laughs> are how well you know someone else's last wishes. <laughs> uh, I also use other films and film clip presentations that okay. um, address various issues. We're all talking between the film clips, but in this mm -hmm. case, we're watching the entire movie and then talking about it afterwards. I think that's afterwards. great. Okay. Well, you know, we've that's always said every time you're here is that it's a reality. It's something, the one thing we know for certain in our lives we're going to have to face. So what key pieces of information then does everyone need to know before there's a death in the family? Because sometimes it's very unexpected. Yes. So something you want to pull together about everybody you might be in in put in a position to plan a funeral for. Mm -hmm. Social security number. Okay. You know your own. Do you know your husband's, your right. spouse's, your parents? Where they're born, place of birth, that goes on a death certificate, veterans information, and mother's maiden name, because mm. all of that mm -hmm. is related to the death certificate. And the fifth thing is. in our online world, passwords. You die oh. and you take your passwords with Isn't you. Isn't that just Your truth. family's in a heap of trouble. Okay. Yeah, so could be tough to get through. Be prepared. Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right, well, we want to make sure that our viewers also take a look at some of the different things you're doing. You do a lot of different talk shows. You do a lot of different I have an internet radio show on the rockstarradionetwork.com. Okay, com, great. And a TV show coming out as a DVD series series and it will be available for online streaming downloads through a good goodbye.com. Fantastic. Gail, thank you so much. Well, and we want to go see that Great movie info. for sure. <laughs> Thanks thank again. You.